Hello there, what is going on everyone? Today we are doing some Mandalorian fun. We're going to be unboxing the Pride of Mandalore expansion for Star Wars X-Wing. This is a five faction pack, so we're going to be getting uh, stuff for five of the seven factions available in Star Wars X-Wing. So if you guys didn't already know, there's a lot, a lot of value in this particular pack. You're going to get a ton of new, beautiful, beautiful stuff. So... With all of that being said, plus new pilots too, and ship cards, right? Like, like very cool stuff. Um, 10 ship cards, 50 upgrades, four quick builds, two conditions, five ship dials, eight ship tokens, three asteroids, three debris, the debris, debris clads. I'm leaving that in. And 21 other tokens. If you guys haven't already, make sure you're subscribed. Enter to win that lightsaber we got going on right now. All you have to do, if you want to win the lightsaber, you just have to be a subscriber and leave a comment uh, on this or one of my videos that's going to enter you. You're going to have a chance to win that way. Um, also, big thanks to today's sponsor, Luxury Playstyle. Amazing full metal tokens. They are absolutely wonderful. You see me talking about them all the time. Uh, they are all double-sided. You know, it, look it, look at these. Like you get so much fantastic. Uh, like they're heavy. They're like look at this. This the stress has a two on the back too. So you, if you double up on your stress, you can do that. Uh, all of your exhaustible tokens. Uh, look at that. They're just they're fantastic. I love them. You hear me talk about them. You're gonna save fifteen percent if you use code Crabock VIP. So uh, also orders of uh, thirty five dollars or more are gonna get a free Crabock token thrown in right with the lightsaber nunchucks on there awesome stuff it's got the five on the other side so you can use it to mark damage and damage games or you can mark critical hits and x-wing with the c pretty cool stuff all right let's go ahead and get this thing unboxed we're gonna take a look at it here we've got some cardboard we've got uh four big pieces of cardboard we'll take a look at those oh look at those oh, pretty rocks they're very very pretty rocks we've got um We've got, this is, this is actually it for all the cards, so it's not that much, I mean, well, it is a lot of cards, that's for sure, especially since it's, I'm pretty much, I'm pretty sure it's all new stuff, which is really cool. Look at Moff Gideon right there. We're going to look at every single card in here. We have got our, our Pride of Mandalore component list, so if you wanted to see everything in here, uh, I think there's all of it right there. You can probably pause. All right, let's see, um, what else do we have? We've got new rules. All right, the blaze bomb, the electro chaff cloud isn't really new. Revealed maneuvers, uh, all of that stuff. Um, oh, yeah. Look at the art. There's so much great art in this pack, too. Like, this ship needs to show up in Armada, maybe. I don't know. It might, it's a little too awkward, I think, for for, for X-Wing. might be a little, a little too big, you know? Um, here we go. We've got... Uh, We've got our, our little uh, beautiful stuff. Oh, Michael Gurness and Max Brook working on this wave. So very cool, very cool stuff. And uh, nice. You know, this was one of the ones that was done under Fantasy Flight. So we still haven't seen anything uh, like under AMG that is actually being uh, announced. Yet, so. All right, let's, uh, let's go ahead and bust these open, take a look at the cardboard and the cards. All right, so we've got our cardboard here. Let's let you get, get a look at both sides. I'm loving the new tokens, the beautiful asteroids. The debris cloud is uh, it's actually really cool there. I think that's, I'm not sure what ship that is. It, it looks like it's an A-wing from the sides, but the front looks a little bit more like uh, like a, maybe a gunboat. Uh, this is def definitely an A-wing right there. So, yeah, it's, I think there's definitely supposed to be A-Wings. So, of course, I guess an A-Wing doesn't necessarily have to look like an A-Wing after it's been destroyed. We got some more dials for the Fang Fighters. We got all of our cardboard inserts. This is something that, you know, if, if AMG was going to do a whole new edition, I wish they would just get rid of um, the need to have a separate insert for every single person's name, you know. So, that, you know, that's that, that's my tips, AMG, if you're, if you're listening. Um, some more. We got that uh, the electrostatic, uh, the bushes. It's the bushes. That's what it is. It looks like armpit hair right there. No, it doesn't. Um, but uh, and then we got our cards here. Let's take a look at the cards. All right, so we start off with Moff Gideon. He is uh, certainly not in a TIE Outlander. Like, it's like it's not a whole separate thing. So, I like, it's like, are we not going to get a TIE Outlander? Probably not. So, we're probably just getting, you know, this is just his TIE Fighter. So, you know, it's just a TIE LN. You know, I'm like, ah, I feel like that's a cop-out. We're going to get... Two copies of the ISB Jingoist. We are going to get competing for greatest artwork of all time on a ship. It's going to be Fen Rao for the Rebels. We got uh, Bodica Venge for the Rebels. 
And then we've got Dirk Uladen and two of the Clan Ren volunteers. They they volunteered to be here. They weren't they weren't forced to be here. Uh, we also have some Mandalorian Royal Guard, two copies of those for the Scum and Villainy faction. We also have some quick builds here. So first quick build, which I'm not sure how much longer these are gonna be viable. I don't know if anybody's really playing quick builds, right? I like I think uh like they really should have just gone ahead and put all the text on these, but it is what it is, right? We got Fenrau there and a Clan Ren volunteer. We got Bodic Avenge and Dirk Uladen. Got Moff Gideon and the ISB Jingoist. And then the Mandalorian Royal Guard and the other Mandalorian Royal Guard. So those are our thingamabobbers. Uh, we've got some upgrades. We've got Sabine Wren with the Trials of the Darksaber. This is going to be fun for epic play. We have, um, we've got, oh man, we got, all right, so we got three copies of Clan Training for, requires Mandalorian. Uh, these, I guess these aren't all new cards. We've got two copies of Dead Eye Shot. We've got two copies of Ion Limiter Override. We've got two copies of the Marg Sable. We've got Compassion. We have Malice. Wait, is, that a, is this a flipper? No, it's not a flip, no. Yeah, we just got the two versions of that. We've got the Electro Chaff Missiles. We have Season 7 Ahsoka Tano Crew Republic or Scum. We have lots of named characters. Here they come. Bo Katan Krees for Republic or Separatists. We also have her doppelganger, Bo Katan Krees for Rebel or Scum. We have Captain Hark. We've got, oh, I'm not running this guy as a crew, but we got Fen Rao. I'd much, much rather have him as a, uh, as a pilot for Rebel or Scum. We've got Gar Saxon. And we've got our boy Corky. Only one copies of all of these, since they're all uniques anyway. Uh, we've got Obi-Juan Kenobi. Not, not Obi-Juan. Why am I putting an H in there? I don't know why I want to put an H in Obi-Wan's name. We've got uh, Pre Vizsla. We've got Prime Minister Almec, who is a flippable card to Almec Maul's puppet. We'll put him back that way. We've got Rookcast, a.k.a. the Armorer. Um, we've got uh, Satine Kreese. We've got Savage Operas. It's, it's the, it's, of all the operas, it's the most savage. No, Savage Opress. Kicking butt. And next one, we've got Tal Merrick, who comes with the false friend condition, which is right there. We've got Tristan Wren. I'm getting Legion, uh, you know, Legion flashbacks to, to heaven. All of the beautiful, beautiful Clan Wren miniatures. Love those. Ursa Wren. Mama Wren joining the, the, the pack. We have... Oh, we have Maul. This is a different Maul. This is Scum Maul. So, Maul... Or I should say Double Crew Maul. Because the other Maul is also Scum. But he's a Double Crew Maul. So, that's that's his, his distinction. We've got Gar Saxon. We've got two copies of Suppressive Gunner. We've got Tiber Saxon. We've got a Gunner version of Ursa Wren, which is pretty cool to have both crew and gunner. We have two of the uh, two copies of Weapons Systems Officer. Now we're getting into the non-people upgrades. Uh, we've got uh, False Transponder Codes. We've got the Blazer Bomb. This is one of the new ones. We've got concussion bombs. We've got thermal detonators. Because she's holding a thermal detonator. We've got the delayed fuses. We've got two copies of overtuned modulators. Here's uh, some nice new ones. We've got three, count them, three copies of the Beskar reinforced plating. There we go. Uh, and we've got three copies of the Mandalorian Optics. I think most everything here, most of it, was already spoiled by AMG, but uh, some of this stuff was also leaked elsewhere online.
All right, you guys, that's going to do it for this unboxing. I know it was kind of quick. I didn't necessarily read every single card to you, but, you know, that's uh, there's, there's too much there. It'd be a like, four-hour video to really go over every single card. There's plenty of time for that. Plus, we kind of went over so many of them during all of the previews, uh, and you're just going to have to play them and, uh, and, and and kind of experience them for yourself. A, a huge, uh, huge shout-out to the great folks over at Fantasy Flight uh, for, for putting packs like this together. This is one of the best things I think you can do for a game is just have a, 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 a much cheaper expansion pack that gives you way massive loads of content, uh, as well as some other cards in here for catch-ups, you know, catch-up cards for other players. Uh, just, like, more content in this pack than in any one other pack, you know, outside of maybe, like, the, you know, the, the, the mini starters and stuff like that that we've seen, you know, that have, like, three ships in them and you know, it's it's that level of, of content that's just absolutely fantastic. So really happy to see uh, stuff like this. If you guys want to see more, you're in the right spot. I invite you to check out the links that are in the description below. Of course, uh, don't forget Luxury Playstyle. Don't forget to check out everything else we've got going on. I want to thank you guys so much. Join our Discord. We've got giveaways that are happening there. And I will talk to you guys later. Big thanks to my patrons. You guys are absolutely amazing and help make this all possible. I will talk to you later. And as always, may the force be with you. And always wear your socks on your feet.